you guys, welcome back to Rosebuff. Today is October 4th, 2017. It's uh, a very pretty sunset tonight. How you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing okay. I am feeling a little bit better after my cold. I did leave work early today just because I wasn't feeling quite 100%, but I'm feeling a little bit better now after a nap. Anyways, uh, from Gaston. Oi, Crystal, how have you been feeling lately? If you're worrying about something you can't talk about face to face, just ask for my advice in a letter. It might help, just try it, Gaston. Nobody is friendly like Gaston. <laughs> okay, I need to stop with those jokes. Gets to be a little much. Anyways, uh, I don't remember what we did last time. I just remember I was not feeling well. I know that we didn't stream. No, we did. Yes, I think. We streamed Animal Crossing, right, didn't we? On Saturday, I think. Bob, we need to change that shirt. Desperately. I woke up this morning and my pillow was at my feet. I did a complete 180 in my sleep. That means if I go to sleep starting the wrong way around, then I'll wake up facing the right way tomorrow. Now that is a good idea. I've actually done that before IRL. It's quite quite confusing to wake up um, not in the right position. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's just, let's just wander around. We'll see what happens in this episode. I have zero plans. Hi, Robin. I think fruit is the most beautiful thing in the world, don't you agree? Of course you do. They're like jewels, aren't they? Everyone dazzling in its own delicious way. Are you are you hungry by any chance, Robin? Yeah, see, what did I just tell you guys? <laughs> sure. I think I have some perfect peaches. And I've been trying to give my villagers perfect fruit if they ask for like any, but I don't want to waste the perfect peaches, so I'm just gonna grab her. Seriously? I need to grab her- oh right, we built that last time. Now I remember. Um, perfect. Okay, I'll grab it from this one. <laughs> oh, I thought we were gonna lose one, but we didn't. That's awesome. Alright, here you go. Okay, there you go. We'll maybe give one of those to Shrunk later. We'll see about that. An exotic screen, thank you. Not exactly sure if I wanted it, but I'll take it anyway. Oh, I'm not used to the five o'clock eating these. Like, usually I'm, I, if I get home, I'm like recording around like, you know, Maybe six or seven, so it's it's kind of different uh, filming during this time of day with you guys. Those are those are quite large fish. I'm just gonna leave it for now. <laughs> I'm I'm kind of in a very lazy, very laid back mood. Make sure there's nothing down here. No, okay. I'm gonna fill in this space, these spaces right here. I've been very, very lazy about doing that. Ooh! Dragonflies are out. Cool. Were they out last time? Maybe they were. <laughs> I think they were, actually, now that I think about it. But, like, the big ones. I don't think I've seen the, the really big ones out just yet. Or maybe they were already out and I just somehow entirely missed them. That is always a possibility. I don't really put it past myself. <laughs> okay. So unfortunately the ground hasn't changed color fully yet. I'm not exactly sure when that will be. I'm not gonna bother, you know, looking it up. I'd rather it kind of be somewhat of a surprise to, you know, walk out that door and be like, oh, it's fall. <laughs> like, properly. Um, we need to finish paying that off. I have no clue how much we have left. I just know that obviously I have not had the time to earn much bells between when I planted that. Planted? Planted. When I uh, put that down and uh, now. We moved over some of the blue violets over here. They're looking really awesome. I love this little area. Uh, 
I can't tell if <laughs> any more bread, but oh well. There's something else. Okay. Peggy, how is it going? At least you're still wearing an okay shirt. I like your opinion on something. I want to add something new to my room. I just haven't seen that special. Oh, I have something special for you because I remember what your house looks like now. I already got it. <laughs> Robin gave it to me. There you go. I'll be sure to put this in my room just as soon as I get home. <laughs> Mr. Flamingo. <laughs> <laughs> I am so okay with having that. Thank you very much. Okay, so obviously she's on her house, but Shep is in his house. So let's go say hello to him. He is such a cutie. I forgot what type of villager he was. I was just actually looking through my amiibo cards before I started filming. And I'm just like, what is he again? Like, not, not species, obviously, but like villager type. Oh, that's right. The other day I talked to... <laughs> Ark. Ark, why you be creeping on my Shep? Let's see. He seemed like he was a bell pit. Oh, burn. <laughs> I'm no longer a bell pincher, so I can make fun of you. You get the chance someday to stay up all night talking and laughing. I mean, that's kind of already happened. <laughs> Shep, get with the times. <laughs> Peggy creeping behind town hall. Okay, so I think that's just about it. Hi, bud. Everything up here. Gal is in her house, so I guess we should go say hello. I really should start paying a bit more attention to her, I guess. I love her. I, I do love her, and I know that I'm going to get attached, but that's kind of why I haven't been speaking with her. Oh, you lost one of your piggy banks already? She usually comes with two. You know, there's an easier way to change the tool you're holding than- Okay, yes, you're, just, you're giving me- you're giving me tutorials? I've been playing this game, this town specifically, for ten months now. This game in general for the last, like, what, four years? <laughs> and this series <laughs> for- Oh, geez, far longer than I'd rather count, actually. Oh, Melba! At least you're wearing a really cute shirt, actually. I hear you're a bit of a hometown hero. That was what I'm being called now. It wasn't a civic leader, it's hometown hero, and I like that one better. You're the topic of a lot of conversations around town. Oh, you're just the sweetest thing. She is never, ever allowed to leave. Also, we just need one more here and I will be so happy. Uh, sunny all day. The autumn moon should appear bright in the night sky, so keep your eyes up. Oh, maybe I should record tomorrow. I don't know. We are on episode, I believe, 99 right now, so next episode will be episode 101. I was about to say 101. Counting with Crystal. Uh, episode 100. Which is very exciting. I honestly I don't really have like a big thing planned for it. I was just gonna do a bit of a longer episode and uh, maybe take a tour around town and just share some memories of creating it with you guys, but I don't know. It's gonna be sappy. It's not gonna be anything too cool or anything like that. Did did we get another one? Oh right, I watered these. Right. Right. Okay. Let's try and get some more. There we go. That's the music I'm used to for uh, filming with you guys. Okay, nothing. 
Nothing back here. Oh! Oh, hi, bud. Here's a little something I thought you'd like. I really struggled thinking who to give my pipe organ to, but I realized you were the one. Thanks? Oh, here you try. You really do try, bud. Oh, gosh, this bunny. Okay, I need to finish this area. I kind of started on it, like, a couple months ago and never finished it, which is kind of bad. Also, I think I'm, like, 90% sure I've already caught that. That's why I'm not really bothering with it, even though we've seen, like... Oh, gosh, quite a few tonight. Oh, I was hoping for another person at the campsite. I'm, I'm a little bit bummed about not having... The villagers that I want. Like, I, I don't know. I feel kind of guilty taking them from other people and I kind of want to have to like work for them and I'd love to invite a villager from the campsite as part of the let's play. That's something that is kind of a goal of mine just to show off I guess that feature of the game because I think it's quite cool. Um, it's just getting the villagers to cooperate and have someone move in who I actually really want. That's the hard part. So let's go donate stuff. We'll go update the dream suite, I think, just because I really like this time of evening. The lighting is really pretty. After that, I want to go and hear a joke from Shrunk. And also, I want to check out Nuts Homes because uh, I still am looking for a new door. I clicked the wrong button. <laughs> My bad, bladders. Okay, there we go. Also, can't re can't can't remember. Can't forget to check out the Evil Sisters because we're supposed to be collecting the costumes for uh, for Halloween. So that's something we should really remember to do. So, I think, question of the day, because I don't always do these, it's more so when I can think of one that I like while I'm recording, which is not every time I record. Uh, but question of the day, uh oh. Wow. <laughs> uh, I have to do a system update. Not gonna do that mid recording. But anyway, question of the day. Uh, Unless you need to update your 3DS, how often do you uh, update your Dream Suite? Do you do it every time you play? Do you do it maybe every week? Every, you know, how often do you update? Because I know when I used to play a bit more frequently, when I, like, you know, had time, uh, I would do it every single time I played. Because, you know, 5,000 bells a day, that's pretty nice. For essentially doing nothing but sleeping. <laughs> Sleepy joke. Okay, I could use this one. <laughs> Have you heard? Yawns are contagious. There was one day years ago when I was performing in front of a totally packed audience. Well, uh, packed might be a tiny exaggeration. I was performing in front of a good number of people, so I thought I'd share a special joke I'd been saving. Just then, some big guy sitting smack dab in the middle of the audience let out a huge yawn. Then it started to spread from row to row. The yawn caught on and... 
Huh? What? What joke was I doing again? Alright, great stuff. How far are we? Okay, so we have like nine more left. That's pretty darn good. If I was to do it, uh, if I was to play for the next nine days, we would have it really quickly, but I'm probably not gonna do that. And I tend to do this only like when I'm streaming or when I'm uh, recording for you guys as well. Look, your selection of doors, it... Yeah. Why? <laughs> it's so... Tiny. Okay. Let me go sell off this stuff. I don't really need it. Uh, come back, do some shopping at TIY, and then head over to the Able Sisters. Um... I'm trying to think. I want to earn some bells. Maybe I'll go do a trip to the island later on to- <gasps> Oh, it's fine. No, it's fine. <laughs> we have like a thousand of those. Um, but maybe- Whoops, sorry, Peggy. We'll do a trip to the island, or I'll do a trip to an island- To an island. I can't talk tonight, you guys. I can't. Sentences, words, English. <laughs> um, I personally will go take a trip to the island after recording, maybe a bit later, and just catch some, uh, catch some beetles, because, uh, I could use them bells since I haven't been playing the stock market and I lost so many the other day or the other week. Okay, uh, so that's done. I cannot remember for the life of me how much we have left on that public works project, so uh, knowing my luck, it's probably exactly the amount we have, and now we're gonna go buy stuff, and it's <laughs> knowing my luck, but uh, hopefully not. What is this one? Oh, I think I already have this one. I think so. <laughs> I remember the uh, the KK performance for this one. <laughs> I want any of this to be honest. Thank you though. Okay, so I have a theory. A lot of people have been telling me to just go ahead and replace these so that no one can dress up from like you know someone from any town's designs uh, I've never actually replaced these so just out of curiosity oh no I didn't want to click on this one this one isn't that bad <laughs> it's this one that I don't like display my design can can I what I'm so confused. Is it because they're like different types of designs? Fashionistas let me know. I have no clue. I never mess around with the QR codes as you guys probably have noticed. I'm buying this shirt. Someone in Rosewood might li or sorry, Rose Woof might like it. Also I'm buying this. Very nice. Uh, I don't want any of the other stuff there. Uh, 
Uh, we got that one last time, didn't we? Also, this is very expensive. If you guys have not seen this yet in your own games, which I assume most of you have, but... I mean, you know, it's not that expensive, but considering it's just a hat... It's quite expensive. Um, yes. That was all I wanted. So, I wonder why I can't put my designs there. I did QR code them all in, but I don't think that would make a difference. I'm not entirely sure though, to be very honest with you. Give me these. If you couldn't tell, I'm kind of collecting stuff that might look good for like the rest of the outfits for the Halloween stuff because I think Jack pretty much only says go get the hoods or like the masks. I want to get like the full outfit. <laughs> so I'm just gonna be kind of collecting them and it helps get like the uh, the mannequins and stuff for uh, the Able Sisters for in terms of buying stuff from them so I should probably do more of it, <laughs> to be quite honest. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Let's go check out this public works project and see exactly how much it is, because I can't remember. Oh, we're really close. Uh... Oh, wait. No, that's not what I wanted to do. I forgot a zero in there. That makes me feel a little bit better. Even numbers. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's go put away our stuff. I I need to do some storage cleaning, to be quite honest. I have a full thing of, you know, rotten turnips that I need to get rid of that I'm kind of scared to see how much Reese is gonna make me, uh... Make me, uh... Pay to dispose of them, because I don't have the garbage can or anything yet, right? So... Do I have any space whatsoever? I kind of have stuff in here that, like, I don't need to have in here technically, so... Like, look at all this. <laughs> that's really bad. I don't know what that's there for, so I'm just gonna get rid of it. I don't need the roses. Alright, I'm just gonna go sell all this stuff. Uh, actually, I... I wasn't keeping those bugs because I want to donate them, was I? I don't think I would do that. It's not like me to hoard them like that, but I'm still gonna go check just in case. Oh, wait, nope. Just those ones for now. I owe you 40 bells? Okay, that's fine. Okay. Oh, sorry, buddy. Running into my villagers everywhere tonight. Okay, let's just go make sure that these aren't something that I was, for some odd reason, saving to donate. It, it really, like, whenever I get something new, you guys should probably know by now, I run straight to the museum to donate it. Um, I can't think of any reason why I would put it in my storage, but just on the off chance. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> One of them. That's totally fine by me. 
and I would not have known. Because when I catch one, I would have seen that, oh, it doesn't come up with the encyclopedia thing, so I probably donated it. Oh gosh, I am feeling so lucky tonight. <laughs> oh gosh, that, that was pretty close. Um, so next up, just to wrap up the episode, I want to do something that we haven't done in quite a little while, actually. Um, we're gonna go work part-time in the cafe. I believe it's still open, maybe? Like, still open in terms of working there? I'm not entirely sure about that now that I think about the time, but hopefully. Just because uh, I had someone suggest that I go there again the other day, because I haven't done it in quite a while. dude. Hey, so the wandering coffee lover returns. You dig in on Brewster's bruise as well? Hello? Welcome. How can I help you? Uh, I want to work. Sorry, I don't really need any help. Oh, gosh darn it, Brewster! Is it because you're here, KK? I can't even sit beside you. This is sad. I'm gonna get a coffee anyway. I guess maybe it's because I remember it's not too early in the morning and I guess obviously now it's not too late at night either so it must be like a like an afternoon sort of thing maybe uh, I like lots try this well seasoned brew So mellow. Adding a lot of milk to coffee gives it such a mild flavor. Thank you. Alright then, you guys. I think we're gonna have to end this episode here, so thank you very much for watching. I'm just gonna go just gonna go creep on uh, on KK a little bit. So anyways, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will. See you guys next time.